Hi everyone, in my previous video I have shown you how to update storage of this laptop. In today's video we are going to see how to update RAM of this laptop. After updating the RAM I have tried playing Battlefield 1 and there is a huge improvement in performance as well as FPS which you can see in these photos. And you, you may compare to the gameplay video I have uploaded earlier. I was not able to get uh, above 110 FPS before. Now I am getting up to 144. Let's first remove the screws uh, so that we can remove the back panel and these are the screws you have to remove. In my previous video, where I have shown you how to install an SSD or a SATA hard drive, uh, it is a laptop. And like I have shown in that previous video, uh, this is a RAM 1 slot where HP Avala installed an HGB RAM. This is a slot 2. This is Hyperx RAM which I have brought online. Uh, this is a 3200 MHS 8GB RAM DDR4. And I will put a link to this RAM in the description box below. If you are planning to update your RAM, of your laptop any laptop i recommend you to buy a new ram with the same frequency as of the ram which is already installed in, in your laptop right now otherwise it will only lead to decrease in performance of your current channel ram just like that you can install ram in the ram slot just make sure that you are holding the correct uh, direction and after placing it into the correct position just push down as shown in this video after installing you need to place this cover back now let's put the back panel back and after that we need to slightly apply pressure on all our sides that the back panel will get locked into the body like it was before And I'm not going to put the screws back now. Let's first boot the lap up and check if everything is working perfectly and uh, if RAM is showing. Successfully booted up. Now let's check the RAM. As you can see, 16 GB is shown here. Uh, in CPU insert, uh, let's go to where is? Uh, let's go to memory. Let's go to slot two. This is a RAM I have in, uh, installed right now. As you can see, it's it's a three thousand two hundred megahertz RAM. If you guys have any doubt, feel free to ask in the comment section below. Now, since everything is working fine, let's put the screws back in. And thanks for watching, and see you in next video.